The following video contains strong language which may be offensive for some viewers. Viewer's discretion is advised. Enjoy the audio. I wonder how many Walmaria refugees are starving as we, their supposed protectors, feast on what little resources the walls have to spare. It's only a matter of time before all hell breaks loose, and those of us assigned to maintain order finally realize just how bad we are at our jobs. If you were going for stealth, you must have no idea who you're trying to sneak up on. Just what the hell are you trying to do? Awfully quiet. I don't know what else I would expect from a shady figure with a weapon alone on a balcony. I'm trying my best to be polite, but if you move that knife even a centimeter closer to me, I will tear you apart. Huh? Was that an invitation? Shame to kill something so beautiful. Too bad. Face. And just who the hell are you? What the fuck is going on? How did they manage to catch me so off guard? That face. I know that fucking face. The core? No, they look too mature to be a cadet, and I would easily recognize them if they were a seasoned veteran. Too easy. How kind of them to leave me a weapon. <laughs> it's dull. But it will work. Convenient. Not a word, and forget about trying anything.
hands on the table. Surprise, I'm awake. Isn't that exciting? Not so brave now, are we? <laughs> you had this planned all along, didn't you, you little shit? Don't act like you're fucking surprised that I recognized you. Those eyes, that hair, you're an underground debt collector. One that I avoided for years in that hellhole. So, tell me, which underground loan shark asshole wants me dead so badly they would send one of your kind to the surface? Don't lie to me. If you weren't hired and sent here on a job, why the hell else would you be on the surface jumping military officials at fancy banquets? Huh. <laughs> Even if I did believe that you're here on your own free will, which I don't, you still haven't come up with an excuse for your habit of abducting captains. Just me, huh? What? Are you gonna tell me that I'm special or some shit? Don't tell me you came all the way up here on your own free will, with no compensation to look forward to, just to fail miserably at keeping your only target restrained. You're pathetic. <laughs> No, I'm not going to ask any more questions. I'm simply uninterested in wasting any more time in this dump with a shitty excuse for a debt collector. Especially one who is pretending they didn't spend countless months in the underground pursuing me only to fail every time. Go back to the underground. Or don't. I couldn't care less. Just know, next time we're in this predicament, you having to attempt to pursue me for debts I have no intention of paying off, I won't be so kind. Consider my mercy a gift, for old times' sake. Oh, so you remember me after all. <laughs> Thank you for agreeing to go over mission plans with me, Captain Levi. I appreciate your time. Sure. Lay out what you already have planned. I'm assuming we're sticking with Ervin's formations? That's right. Well, for the most part. What's that supposed to mean? Assigning spots in the formation is easier said than done. Especially when you throw in anomalies like you, Aaron, Mikasa, and that new recruit Erwin was talking about. What new recruit? Um, I was actually watching them train earlier. They seem to have tons of field potential. But not in the way anybody would expect. They're stupid skilled when it comes to handling a blade. From what Erwin's told me, 
They will be utilizing the inner formation to act as Erwin's personal bodyguard. Not against Titans, but against soldiers that don't quite fall in line. It's unclear why he believes he needs a bodyguard. I've seen his combat skills firsthand. But I do what I'm told when it comes to the commander. I want you to have this new recruit join me in my office for a proper orientation. Um, all right then. Yes, sir. Ah, the new recruit, was it? What did I tell you about continuing to pursue my debts? That's not why you're here? Yeah, right. All right then, what is it? Why are you here? Why the hell would Erevin need a personal bodyguard? Danger? From what? The underground loan sharks. What about them? What do you mean they're after him? Why would they be after someone who has only been to the underground once? Once is all it takes, huh? Why should I believe a word coming out of your mouth? Because you're trying to protect me? <laughs> I don't trust you. So here's what we're going to do, recruit. You are going to sit here, and you are going to tell me everything you know about the loan sharks that you worked for in the past. Because we both know your hands are not clean. I remember you from the underground. I remember the bloody corpses of those who owed your bosses money. You were a stone-cold murderer. Don't pretend like you weren't. If you tell me the truth, you will be assigned in the formation to stay between both mine and Ervin's squads with the mission of protecting Ervin at all costs. If you leave my line of sight for a second, I will find and kill you before you even get the chance to come up with another dim-witted liar alibi. One chance is all you get. No, I'm not being kind to you. I simply have been a first-hand witness to a nobody from the underground fighting for the sake of humanity. Do not get the wrong idea. I do not trust you. Not in the slightest. You are still a debt collector from the underground. You're just a debt collector that I'm giving a chance. Don't screw it up. Now go!
recruit. You remember your assignment. You remember the stakes. I chose to believe your story. Don't make me regret it. What the? Hey, why the hell are you breaking formation? All scouts maintain assigned spots until directed otherwise. These soldiers are heading straight for Ervin's spot in the formation. Shit, the recruit better know what they're doing. Hey! Pay attention! It is highly likely we are under attack! Keep your guard up and- uh, uh, uh. Damn it! My horse! Shit. I think I broke my leg in a rib or two from that fall. Don't tell me. You're all going to try to collect some kind of debt from me? Please, be my guest. <sighs> my leg is worse than I thought. You had orders to protect Erevin. <laughs> you better be right about his safety. What? Expect a thank you or some shit? I could have fought off those boneheads on my own. My leg isn't that bad. Ah! <laughs> uh. No, I'm fine. Come on, your horse will be useful in getting us back to the rest of the formation. How far behind did we get? We've been riding for hours and there's no sign of the core. At this point, it's going to be more useful to set up camp for the night. We won't be able to defend ourselves from titans we can't see. There, a cave. We can seek shelter there until the sun rises. Yesterday, when I asked why you were helping us, I didn't like your answer. It was obvious you were dodging the question. The 
Yes, I noticed. It wasn't hard to tell. So, tell me, why are you helping the scouts? Me? What? You're helping the scouts because of me? I told you, I've known you before. All I knew of you in the underground was how vicious you were with your so-called clients. Don't act like you know me. Stop saying that. You have no idea who I am. Yes, I remember the day you caught me off guard on the balcony. How does that have anything to do with this? Yes, I remember that. I remember calling you beautiful. I see. You were sent here for me, weren't you? God, as much as I want to call you a liar, there's something in those eyes that just makes me want to believe you. So, Tell me, why didn't you kill me when you had the chance? D don't avoid my question. <sighs> yes, I meant what I said. You are beautiful. I answered your question. Now answer mine. You were... intrigued by me? What the hell is that supposed to mean? Okay, then. New plan. You finish setting up a fire, and I'll work on getting us some food. Once we've got those two items ready to go, I'll cook us some dinner. And you are going to tell me everything there is to know about you. I want to know everything, down to the smallest detail. Then will rest, and tomorrow morning, we'll head back for the walls, since I doubt we'll run into the rest of the formation out here in the plains. Got it? Interesting. So, you've only been on the surface for a few weeks? From the looks of it, I would have guessed much longer. Hmm. 
like me? Oh, I've been up here for a few years now. I was recruited by Irvin. Not that I had much of a choice in the matter. Yes. However, past murder attempts will remain in the past. No, it's not ironic that I commanded you to protect the man I once swore to kill. It's not because I, myself, would lay down my life to ensure that man remains the leader of the Scouts in humanity's hope. Oh, you're curious about Aaron, huh? I wouldn't stress about it too much. That kid has just as many raging teenage hormone problems as he does real-world titan problems. I'm sure you'll see his ugly-ass titan one day. It's not something to look forward to. Relax. God, you're just like four eyes, aren't you? Not a compliment. I wouldn't call Four Eyes my friend. Excuse me? Yes, I have had friends. Not like you were the life of the party in the underground either. What was it they used to call you? The Unholy Gatherer or something like that? You have no place calling me names with a nickname like that. You're not getting off the hook that easily. So tell me, what is your name? Your actual name? That name fits you. Mine? It's Ackerman. Levi Ackerman. The fire's almost out. You should get some rest. No, I don't think laying together is the best idea. need rest. Tomorrow could be hell. There really is no telling what to expect from the land outside of the walls. You need your energy. I won't say it again. Rest. We'll continue this conversation tomorrow. I'm sure we'll have plenty of time. Huh? What was that? Uh, oh. Yeah. Good night.